exhibition is actually an overview of her work from the 60s up to the present day. She's in her 80s, she's still working, and it's a really important... So, um, this is the third venue in the Rago exhibition. It was in Milton Keynes and then Edinburgh. You know, everybody is a victim. Babies, the innocent. Yeah, no, yeah. Perspe no real perspective. Like playing, with playing with that. Playing with that. Yeah. 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 But at the same time, it's telling you I'm, I'm not taking any of this nonsense. Leela looked after her husband throughout his illness, and after he passed away, she remained in the This lady's holding her skirt up. Yes. <laughs> so when I look at these paintings, I think about that, about the mother-daughter relationship in Chandy. You're looking in on them. I think that adds to the intimacy, like you're spying in on somebody else's life. She can't contain it, or she's trying yeah, to contain it. Like just the, I feel like your eye is drawn straight to the face. Signify, and there's the kind of the beast or something down here. Is that the regime kind of that's taking control? And still they're subjected, you know, this woman at the front, to um, being yeah. totally Powering, like she's not yeah. a powering woman. Yeah, but it's when funny. you looked at it first. No, I find it yeah. it's a very visceral painting. Like you react to it, and you can see the emotions or experience. Oh, a white rabbit as well, like a pure white rabbit, and then it's bleeding at the mouth. It's kind of grotesque. She was very influenced by Disney, by the dark side of Disney films, you know, okay. and the dark side of folk tales in general. This, it's like she just processes her emotions, as you said, like so honestly. Uh, yeah. It was almost like thrown to her. Uh, like, uh, difficult issues something. that she's really confronted all her life. She's taken them on. And then the little hog. Yeah, the rest of it. 